And now more on the explosion out of Blakesburg that we told you about at the top of the uh, newscast. That's where a tanker truck exploded earlier this morning. Joe Millage with KIIC Radio out of Albia is joining us now on the phone. And Joe, we understand the entire town has been evacuated. What is the latest and are there any injuries? Molly, there is uh, new news, and that is that uh, the town, uh, the fire was put out about 20 minutes ago, and the uh, restriction, uh, the ban to, uh, to leave town has uh, also been lifted. So folks, are, residents are now being allowed back in town. I'm here with uh, uh, Ottumwa Fire Captain Brian Carnahan. He's the incident commander. And Brian, what did you guys see, uh, find when you arrived here today? Um, when we arrived on scene, uh, Blakesburg Fire Department was applying water to a semi-tanker that was carrying approximately 5,000 gallons of diesel fuel and 2,500 gallons of gasoline. He was offloading onto a, a fixed site that had other tanks. Um, when we arrived on scene, we evacuated within a half mile around the area immediately, started calling support for tankers to haul water, and backed our initial efforts up until we could get those tankers in line. And you guys supplied some foam uh, on there. And, uh, Molly, this was a 15 alarm fire, and primarily, uh, Brian, because uh, of the limited water supply here. Correctly. Most of, the, most of the departments that were called in to help were to haul water back and forth through town. So, Molly, uh, one person has been injured and life lighted uh, to a Des Moines hospital. His condition is unknown at this time. Nobody else was injured, but residents are now being allowed back in, and uh, the scene is, has uh, been diffused here within the last uh, several minutes. Okay, that's very good news, Joe. Thank you very much for reporting live for us. We appreciate it. And as we said, Amanda Lewis is on the scene as well, and she will have details for you today at 5 and 6.